Please forgive all the city noises we're shooting outdoors today because it's a nice day. We don't have too many of those in April in Wisconsin. I wanted to talk about early setups. Now, sometimes you've got to go in a little early to set something up for whatever reason. Usually if it's a half hour, maybe even an hour sometimes, I can overlook it. But then I feel like sometimes it's definitely not convenient. Let me give you an example. I've got a photo booth client that today asked me to set up six hours early. And I made a post about this on Facebook. A lot of people ask why do they need it for six hours early. You know, it doesn't matter why they need it. It's what they want. It's for their convenience or for whatever they have arranged with the hall, the vendors and all that stuff. When you're going heavy on hours, when you're going three, four, six or more hours, I think we have to be really careful with that. The way I price all of my services, photo booth and DJ, are real. They're not prices I picked out of thin air. I didn't ask myself, wow, you know, how much can I get from this client? I think about what this really costs me in equipment, as far as the rental goes, and in time, and in materials, and in out-of-pocket expenses. So when you lay on extra time, you got to charge for it. In my contract, I worded it pretty carefully. It says something to the effect of early setup time may result in additional charges, which means if I feel like it's negligible, if it's a half hour, hour, whatever, I can ignore it. But if I feel like that it's excessive, I can charge for it. The number in my head typically is about 50 bucks per additional hour. When you tell this to people, sometimes they work it out where you don't have to come in early because it's for their convenience. If they need you to come in early, sometimes they have to pay for it. And in this case, the guests are showing up, I believe, oh boy, what is it, four hours before I even start, which got me thinking, maybe I should talk to my client about having additional photo booth hours. Instead of her just paying out cash for me just to be there, maybe we can open the booth for an hour or two and she can put the money towards that. And that way I can kind of waive these charges a little more. Might work out for her, might work out for me. I don't know, but I wanted your thoughts. How do you handle those early setups? Let me know in the comment section and let me know what you charge for them. I'd be very curious. Thanks for watching. More videos on the way. Practice and enjoy.